Hello everyone, my name is Andre. welcome back to Car Garage. Today we're gonna be doing a review on my A4 B6 1.8T quadro manual transmission. Start it up. So starting the story of me and this car, um, I purchased in uh, 2013 uh, another, my first Audi, it was the same Audi, only it was um, light blue color and 10 interior, was automatic transmission and it was 2002, and which I kept it for one year and it was okay, it was driving good, it was, it was, it had like less miles like 90, 90 something thousand miles which is good for this engine and I didn't really like it much it was automatic transmission I was looking I was looking and I find this one which is 2005 it has manual transmission it's a quattro it's a 1.8 it's good for uh, upgrades and then I was thinking I was thinking and I got this car and then I sold my other one when I got this car this car had a problem it had the um, uh, head gasket it was blown so I supposed to change the head gasket which I did replaced it and um, the mechanic when he replaced it didn't pay attention that the, the cylinder head was cracked and he just installed it like that I drove it for a while and then he started giving me another problem problems which I replaced the head after that and then still the, ha the car had problems like uh, uh, misfire and all of this then going search research research I find that the Audi TT 1.8 turbo has 225 version horsepower and I start doing my research to see if, if I can fit an engine from a TT, the 225 horsepower, and my A4, which with kind of difficult modification, you can do it. So I have in this car the Audi TT engine, the 225 uh, version horsepower, and it drives well the upgrades that I have on this car I haven't done a tune yet but I have the lightweight pulleys on the crankshaft I have a lightweight pulley on the camshaft and it's adjustable which uh, I haven't done down yet too we can do it on the future I have the Magnaflow uh, exhaust and I had the test pipe but recently I had to pass emissions and the OBD2 would pass but visual catalytic wasn't there so the inspector told me that he wouldn't pass because the catalytic wasn't there so now I put I had a spare catalytic I put the OEM catalytic in it and I want to pass emissions so I'm good right now and stay tuned for that because we're gonna put the test bike back on on this car and of course the, the sound will be more aggressive as you guys uh, hear already heard already the uh, cold start on this car is okay but not 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 really okay and when i was going highway like right now i have 60 uh, you could hear that the exhaust is louder but right now not really 
not heavy, but to get the lightweight
Jakarta sits. That's how I told you guys. Better do it uh, both out of the system. The S4 wheels. Here are the big, big brakes that I was telling you. They're doing their job. Just paint them red so you don't see the Porsche logo. Pretty good. S4 bumper. I got the S4 grill. Same as in the back. The S4 bumper. Pretty good. Now let's see under the hood. Boost gauge. So this is the TT engine. BEA code as you can see the crankshaft lightweight pulley I have a smaller belt the tensional the tensioner is pretty good catch can so it's a stock intake manifold I got a filter it's like from AutoZone the car that we installed a couple of days ago stock turbo very much it. I got the red coil packs. Better spark. Factor Xenon headlights. They're really good. As you can see, the coolant level is okay. It's like only a, a seep from the water pump that I was talking. And we're gonna be doing that the water pump to replace many parts I get it from them sorry about the mess right here of course I'm gonna have some stuff also I got this wing cardboard fiber wing we're gonna be installing it on the uh, back glass This is the water pump that we're going to be replacing it. Germany product. I'm going to replace that. And what else I got? I got that belt that I told you. Racing performance. As you can see, it's harder than the original one. So we're going to be doing that one. We changed the water pump. Pretty much it. And one more thing that I told you guys is this the camshaft pulley from uh, integrated engineering. This adjustable. We're gonna do down to on the time that we're changing the water pump with the belt, we're gonna adjust the, the camshaft. So we'll see how the car is gonna drive. Sounds pretty good, still with catalytic car, but you guys want to see when we put test pipe on, even better.
this was a short video of my A4 B6. Thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, share, like, and comment. And uh, stay tuned for more videos. We're gonna do many, many upgrades in the future for, the, for this car. And you're gonna be the one that you will know about this. Thanks so much.